All right, you see that bitch over there? She's getting a good wash. That's for last time, you jerk. All right, welcome back to Super Mario Sunshine. I am the Infinity Cat, Cora. And last time we took on the Manta Storm and we seized our opportunity in Area 6 with a very well done secret level. So anyway, oh no, not that one. Fortunately, we don't have to deal with that one for quite a while. If I had to deal with that one, it would suck. All right, so this one. This one involves booze. Lots and lots of booze. There are probably on booze. I also should mention that there is a blue coin in this line, so in case you're wondering. Actually, let me, sp let me spray these. I didn't mean spray you, dude. Alright, so these two are just coins. I might as well point out which one's which. I think this one had the blue coin. Now it's the blue coin. Alright, hold on. This one should be farting out a coin for me. Yep, there we go. Now it's a regular coin, so that means number two over there is the uh, one that contains the blue coin, so anyway. He's kind of apologizing for, you know, doubting our awesomeness. Now we gotta deal with ghosts. Fortunately in here, I don't think I got the blue coin because I don't know where it is, so anyway. I know it's in one of these torches. All right, so let's see here. Oh. Turn the strawberry one there into, um, I turned him into a platform. That's the gimmick of this stage, aside from getting into a uh, world, uh, world five's secret stage one. These guys turn into platforms. That's the stage's gimmick, I guess. Just keep watering these guys and they'll be fine. I mean, platforms. Now, I love the fact that these are, like, strawberry colored. I can't be the only one that thinks they look like they're... They would taste like strawberries. And I'll be honest, I'm not actually a big fan of strawberries. But I like strawberry flavoring. I know it's weird, but... Um... Well, honestly, you guys should be used to that by now. Ow! Dude! Dude, where'd you go? There you are. Ow! Dude! Oh, wow. Alright, two in a row. That was awesome. Hello. That's... lovely. I don't think anyone's actually looked over there before, but... Apparently Nintendo had us covered. Basically, it's like an excuse saying, Hey, this is the reason why you can't go up here, asshole. Put a sign. What the hell was that? Oh man, well, I guess it's making up for last time with how well we did. Because, you know, gotta have that Let's Play curse showing its ugly head again. Okay, that's weird. I don't know why Mario wasn't landing on that. Alright. Also, by the way, if you see a coin that's not rotating or whatever, nine times out of ten, that thing is... Um, that's a boo, so don't bother with it. It's annoying. Speaking of annoying, yay! Another secret stage. I'm so thrilled. Uh, I used to really like these stages, but the more I play Mario Sunshine, the less I like them. I mean, they're really well designed. They're nice little obstacle course stages, but good lord, they're so annoying. Let's bounce off of that guy. And that guy. And that guy. I know they have names. They're flying stews. But I just call them that guy and stuff. Kind of sounds like Aqualung Game Reviews um, take on Kid Cool. Now it looks like a nipple. 
Of course I would think it looks like a nipple instead of like, I don't know, a pimple or something. It does kind of look like a zit. I have this annoying zit that's hanging out like right... You ever have those zits that just kind of show up on your chin? Those are annoying. Anyway, I gotta be real careful here because one false move and I fall, especially on that thing. This thing has killed me so many times. I can't tell you how many times. Mostly just because of the way the platform rotates. The trick is moving slow. Not getting in a rush! Yeah, 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 I know I'm cheating. And I died anyway. So there you go. That's what I get for cheating. <laughs> uh, I just got in a rush, that's all. Alright. I don't know why I turned on the hover nozzle. It's not like I'm going to use it. Get out of here, Stu. Oh, wow, that was cool. You see that? That was a pretty good jump there. Alright, goodbye, Stu. So what to talk about today. I think I'll talk about, like, something that I was talking about, like, during the original recording, and I just decided, fuck you, I'm not gonna do that, because, well, screw you. I don't wanna. Well, the thing I was talking about with that one was, um, I was talking about Majora's Mask and how much I really enjoyed that. I've been watching a lot of Nintendo Capri Sun's LP of Majora's Mask. And, yeah, it's pretty good. It's a nice, fun little game. Very strange. I love the dark artwork and stuff. It's like... 2001 must have been a very strange time to be at Nintendo, because that was when you got a lot of the darker games, like Luigi's Mansion. Well, that one's not really that dark, but... Whatever. Huh. All right. Yeah, same result as last time, actually. All right, so I'm gonna wander a little bit and do a dive. And time for another hollow victory! Yay! I did it. I did it without flood. See, it is entirely possible to beat those stages without flood. It's just really annoying having to do it. Yeah, I know. Now we're back up to our primary life total, which is 20. It's nice. Anyway, watching that LP has made me want to go back and replay Majora's Mask on 3DS, because I've gotten past the first three days, but I haven't gotten much farther. Get out of here. I don't like you very much. But the problem is, it's like, I don't know where to start, because I was mostly just listening to the LP. And just occasionally popping in, just to see what was going on. I'm doing pretty good on time. Sorry, I was looking at my clock here to make sure that... I don't do anything stupid. Because I'm doing like two Shine Sprites of video. Unless I like do something really crazy fast. Like, this one shouldn't take too long, because now I know where I'm going, so, anyway. That's not a fucking floodless level. No, no, no. That's the following stage. But anyway, I like Majora's Mask's style. It's just trying to figure out where I'm going is kind of difficult, because the game is not exactly a friend. And what? Wait, we can actually re-race this guy? Okay then. Well, you're gonna lose again, but all right. Yeah, you have to see my original score. Oh, what? Oh, fuck you, you're not nice. Man, he got here fast. Oh, well, it's not really gonna matter anyway. I showed you how to do it. And now you actually know what it's like to fail at that mission. And we're not even that far into the video. So honestly, that one I'm not really going to care about because now you know how to beat the stage. Basically, don't do what I just did. Um, Flood is your friend. I would advise using Flood a lot. 
And, uh, now we must look to the sun. And now I know where to look. Hold it, Shadow Mario! Alright, it's time for the... Oh, so essential Shadow Mario mission. What do you have to say, McGucket? Is that a relative of yours? Quite an odd family you've got. Now, he's no relative of mine. Maybe Peach, because, you know, Peach thinks Bowser's so sexy, but... Anyway. Oh, there he goes, using freaking... You would think by now he would have developed an immunity to freaking water, and yet he isn't. It's really dumb. But anyway, strategy still applies from... Um, Rico Harbor. Basically, hang out somewhere and then just do the deed. Just keep spraying them. Alright, come on. There we go. Just get him in kind of a loop, and then it shouldn't be too bad. See, Shadow Mario's gonna keep trying to hop places because he's an asshole. He's a peeping Tom! Imagine he's a peep and tongue. I mean, Bowser is. We all know Bowser takes a peek at Princess Peach when she's taking a shower, and we know Bowser treats her well. If Paper Mario is anything to believe. Well, with the exception of Color Splash, where Bowser is kind of a shithead to him. I mean, Peach usually gets some pretty good quarters, despite the fact that she is clearly a captive. I mean, that's just Princess Peach in a nutshell, so. Anyway. I'm gonna follow up with Shadow Mario here. Should be nearly done. Alright, where'd he go? He's down there. Really, dude, you're going all the way back down. Alright. Yeah, guess what? I'm gonna piss on you. I'm gonna piss on you and you're gonna, and you're gonna like it. Okay, how did that not stop him? It would have been cool if I actually knocked him out of the air. Well, I'm probably going to get him this next round, so. There goes the wall kick again, not doing what it's supposed to. Okay, I have to bring up something. Mario Sunshine's hit detection with a wall kick or whatever can be a little clunky. As you've seen there, and it's cost me a good number of lives. Anyway, there he is. Alright, Shadow Mario, quit wandering everywhere like an asshole. Alright, come on. Alright, where'd you go? I'm piss on you. I'm piss on you. Oh, he disappeared. Fast little bugger, isn't he? He's faster than Mario is. It doesn't take much, mind you, but still. Man, he's taking more hits this time. Last time, I swear. Alright, so now I gotta adjust myself here. And you get to go down. What? Ah, oh, come on. Well, at least I landed somewhere safe. I didn't take as much damage that time. Usually I take damage there. Alright, come on, Shadow Mario. Fall. Fall like the little bitch that you are. Ah, man. Whoa, come on. I love it that he thinks that Shadow Mario is a relative. I mean, he does look like Mario. It's a pretty good disguise, but... I think Bowser Jr. probably could have done a better job, like, actually make him look like Mario. But he didn't, because, you know, he's a kid, and he's not perfect, and he wanted Mario to look awesome. Pesky game designers. You know, it's weird that I'm saying that Shadow Mario doesn't look enough like Mario. Alright, come on. Ah, that's right. Yeah, you get your ass out of here, Shadow Mario, you freaking swine. Yay. 
All right, and that takes care of Shadow Mario for that stage. I will not miss him. All right. Let's see, we're about 15 minutes. I think that's a pretty good place to stop. I mean, I am tempted to go back into that level over there. But, to be honest, it's the old Piantissimo. Who cares? So, thank y'all. I think Mario's gonna go... Yeah, he's gonna do that. Hope you enjoyed that. Bye.